trying to help clean the kitchen. Yeah, and everything else while I'm here. Just gives us all a sense of community spirit. And, like I said, we use the place, so the least we can do is help get it back up and running. It benefits everyone all around me. Like once in a while, if you can help, like you can. But because also we've got exams and revisions to do, so that a good balance. But if you can help, like you can. Community spirit. Good to help out. Oh, yeah. no, it's good to help out. You just want everybody to get back to normal as soon as you can. Have the floods been a bit of a shock to you? Not to me, because I do it every day. But, um, I think the volume. The extent of yeah, the flooding yeah, has been a bit of. But I've never seen this part since the. Uh, no. I think York's used to dealing with floods, but not to this extent. No. It's just been really good to get involved and to be doing the same thing to help. I think, I, well, myself and a number of people felt quite powerless and didn't really know how to help. Especially when um, the council initially called out for lots of people to go and help, and they were like, no, we're full, we're overrun, we don't need anyone. And you're like, well, I want to do something, I'm not sure what I can do, so it's really good to be here to. An excellent experience, lots of people, good humour uh, and energy to get things right. Nice to finally find some way I can help, you know, this is my home for the foreseeable future and uh, so I've been spending the last couple of days trying to find ways to help out, so when I got the email this morning uh, I was quite pleased just so that I had a chance to, to give my assistance. And so is it, do you think it's important for students to be able to help in the community? Yeah, uh, we, we have to work together. Like this just, you, can't, um, you can't function in isolation. It just doesn't happen. And I think students, they want to get involved, but they just find a way they can without training. Yeah, just a way to serve the community. Yeah, and you'll come to the community centre again when it's all tidied up? Now I will. <laughs> Hi, as a new trustee, what's it been like um, with a situation that was a bit unexpected? Um, it's just a real shame to see um, Town Hall being affected in the way that it has been. And obviously a lot of the community around here have been hit pretty hard. It's, it's important for us to get the community centre up and running as, as quickly as we can really, because we're here to support the local community. But we've had about 10, 15 people down today, so it's been good that we've had so many people helping out. You, you're from the University of York, are you quite pleased to see so many students helping today? Yeah, so I put a message out on Facebook earlier today and that's been shared several times. We've had about three or four students who've come down to help out today which is fantastic. A lot of the students are on holiday at the moment. It's good that the few students that we do have in York are throwing their sleeves up and, and, and looking in. So you the centre manager has finished um, tidying up. How's it been? from your perspective? Um, the flooding wasn't as bad as I thought it would be and thankfully the water is completely cleared now and we've had a huge group of people helping. We've done a great job. What would be your message to ta the people of Tang Hall or the Use the Community Centre? We will be back open up and running as usual next week.